Hello, everyone, and welcome to Pwn to Own Automotive 2024, our inaugural uh, Pwn to Own Automotive competition here in Tokyo, Japan. I am Dustin Childs, head of threat awareness for Trend Micro Zero Day Initiative. With me, as always, is Brian Gorenz. How's it going, Dustin? Good. How are you, Brian? Good, good. good. We have had quite a week uh, and then some getting set up and ready for this competition. So we are as excited to be to, first of all, just say welcome, everyone, to the competition and let you know we have... 51. 51. 51 entries in our very first Pondo and Automotive. And I got to tell you, about a few months ago, we were thinking 15, yeah. 20, maybe if we got lucky. Okay. So, yeah, y'all have outdone yourselves as usual. And uh, we have got a lot to go through. So, every Pondo Own starts like this we have a drawing to determine the order. Now, that order is very important because, first of all, you get to run your thing first and if you happen to collide with someone later well you were first and then someone else collides with you yeah. but also the first round is going to be paid out at 100 percent. but the second and subsequent rounds what are we doing for that we're going to pay out 50 percent of the prize package for everybody else and so there's gonna be a long long three days here trying to get through all of the contestants and try to pay out over a million dollars yeah so if everything hits even with that 50 percent payout we're looking at over a million and a half dollars of awards it's amazing. Um, so the, our budget person is on a different continent right now. <laughs> They're asleep. They don't know this. So shh, don't tell them. Okay. But that's great. We're excited for it. Uh, and as always, we typically start by drawing names out of a hat to get the thing going. But first of all, that's a big hat with 51 yeah. entries. And second of all, we're in Tokyo. Pikachu. <laughs> so without any further delay... We've got 51 names in Pikachu here to draw. Brian, why don't you do the honors right. and draw the first we'll one? The first here. Take the very first one. All right. Uh, so Cena from Cincinnati targeting the charge point home flex in the EV charging category for $60,000 and six master of home points. At some point, a little bit later, <laughs> we'll talk about charge point. <laughs> yes. Okay. Up next, we have... The Synactive team targeting the Ubiquiti Connect EV station nice. for $60,000 and 60 Master of Pwn points. I'm excited about the that. The Ubiquities one. are actually pretty solid. Yeah. Of, of the nice. EV charges I've seen, those are nice hardware. Yeah. Nice hardware. All right. Next up, uh, fuzzware.io targeting the Sony in the IVI category for $40,000 and four Master of Pwn points. That's cool. I'm literally looking forward to that IVI category uh, and see what happens there. Next, we have Synactive targeting the Juicebox 40. For uh, in the EV vehicle chargers category, sixty thousand dollars and six master opponent points. Nice. So Synactive is one of the teams who's bringing a lot of research to this competition, uh, and I look forward to seeing it. All right. Next up is Cena again targeting the Sony uh, IVI device in the IVI category for forty thousand yep. dollars for master opponent points. We three D printed like special IVI holders too. Yeah, it's really super cool. Nice. Uh, yeah, they did good work on that. A new competitor for all the way from Hungary, PC Automotive, will be targeting the Alpine Halo 9 in the IVI category for $40,000 and four nice. Master of Pwn points. Happy to see them in the Pwn to Own competition for their first time. Let's go here. Next up, Midnight Blue and PHP Hooligans targeting the Sony XAV AX 5500 in the IVI category for $40,000 for Master of Home Points. Sony, I need to have some words with your marketing people and your naming departments because that, that's rough. That's okay, lot. That's a lot. You can't go into Target and ask for that. <laughs> Gotta think of these things. They don't have Target. <laughs> they don't have Target here, but they do in the States. Synactive targeting the Charge Points Home Flex in the EV Charger category. Again, 60,000 and six master of pwn points. All right. And yes, every EV charger is targeted. All right. Next up, Brett 2 System targeting the Phoenix Contact Charks SEC 3100 in the electrical vehicle charging category for $60,000, six master of pwn points. We saw that they tweeted out there talking about whispering uh, sweet exploits into, into the uh, Phoenix Contact. So we're looking forward to see that. Yep. I think there's another new uh, player, Cromulence. Yep. Very new. Okay. They will be targeting automotive grade Linux. Woohoo! Nice. With the Blue Z, Ophono, and Conman subsystem bonus in the OS category, obviously, for 60,000 and five Master of Pwn points. Looking forward to that one uh, to see what AGL has in store for it. Yes. Next up, uh, Gary Lee Wang targeting the Sony IVI for $40,000 and four Master of Pwn points. 
Well, you can't go into Don Quixote and say, I need the Sony you AVI. You, right, know, you, you might. might. <laughs> you might. Don Quixote has a lot of stuff. If you're in Tokyo, check out Don Quixote. Upside down. Uh, next up, Cena of Synology is be targeting the Phoenix Contact Charger in the EV Chargers category for 60000 at six master phone points. And then next up. Uh, Cena again targeting the juice box in the smart uh, juice box smart EV in the EV charging category for sixty thousand dollars six master of Pwn points. Cena is a really cool story because he was at Pwn in Toronto, won a bunch of money, and spent a lot of that money on chargers to come here and win more of our money. So that's pretty cool. Uh, Synactive is up next. They will be targeting the Autel Maxi Charger AC Wallbox commercial in the EV charger category, sixty thousand and six master of Pwn points. All right. Next up, let's bring. Uh, Kets, uh, Katsuiko uh, Sato targeting the Alpine I in the IVI category for $4,000 and four master of home points. Hey. Local Japanese contestant. Yeah, super excited to have somebody local as well. Uh, that's really cool. Uh, also excited to have these folks, NCC Group EDG targeting the Pioneer bunch of letters and numbers <laughs> in the IVI category for $40,000 and four master of home points. <laughs> Again, Pioneer, give me a name to go ask for it, Donkey. I mean, that's all I'm saying. All right, Cena targeting the Pioneer device in the IVI category for forty thousand dollars and four Master of Home points. I know there's a Tesla in here yeah, someplace. There is. You gotta dig deep. I know. Look at that. <laughs> Called my shot. Synactive <laughs> targeting the modem in the Tesla category for one hundred thousand dollars and ten Master of Home oh, points. That's gonna be exciting. We're looking that's, forward yeah. to that one. Syn uh, Synactive did some great stuff in Vancouver last year, and uh, looking forward to see what they do next. All right, next up, Cena targeting the Autel Maxi Charger AC wall box commercial in the EV charging category for $60,000, six master of home points. Okay, next up we have the Synactive team. I ah, see I pulled two in a row. Oh. Synactive targeting the infotainment system with a sandbox escape in the Tesla category for $100,000 and 10 nice. master of home points. Looking forward to that one too. And uh, did either or one of those qualify for the automotive award? Uh, I don't think so. No, okay. uh, close. It's close. We actually have a Model Y at the booth. If you're in automotive world, swing by and say yes. hello. Uh, UOK++ targeting Alpine device in the IVI category for $40,000 for Master of Pwn Point. I love that name. UOK++? Yes. I think that's their <laughs> actual Twitter handle, too. Yeah, after, after this week, I don't know if I'm okay. <laughs> yeah, I don't I don't know. It's been a week. Um, and then some. Uh, how are we saying this? Katsuhiko Sato? Sato yes. I'm very sorry. If you know anything about Pondone, you know I can't pronounce names to save my life. But he will be targeting the Sony uh, IVI for $40,000 and four Master of Pwn points. Let's see here. we got a lot to go. Yeah, we do. Oh, man. Cena going again against the Emporia EV Charger in the EV category for $60,000 and six Master of Pwn points. Cena is going to be a busy person. He is. 23, is that what he says? <laughs> oh, oh my goodness, we're not even halfway done. We're not even halfway done yet. Oh, okay, so next up we have the NCC group targeting the Phoenix Contact uh, in the EV Charger category for 60,000 and six Master of Pwn points. All right, got to pick up our pace over here. I know. Let's go. We have All like 36 right. people <laughs> online watching us right yeah, now. Yeah, 2 charging the charge point home flex EV, uh, in the EV charging category for $60,000, six Master of Pwn points. Okay. Oh, there's like multiple ones there. Well, just pick that one. All right. Midnight Blue and PHP Hooligans, they will be targeting Phoenix Contact in the EV Charger category for 60,000 and six Master of Pwn points. All right, here we go again. Next up will be NCC Group, uh, targeting the Alpine device in the IVI category for $40,000 for Master of Pwn points. Okay. All right, next we have Sector 7 by Computus, targeting the Juice Box 40 Smart EV Charging Station in the EV category for 60,000 and six Master of Pwn points. Looking forward to seeing the Sector 7 guys again. Yep, they were Master of Pwn winners at Pwn to Own Miami not that long ago. Yep. Uh, PC Automotive, targeting the Juice Box uh, EV Charger in the EV Charging category for $60,000, six Master of Pwn points. That may or may not be sucking. <laughs> Here, I'll go again. Okay. <laughs> may or may not be sucking. <laughs> 
All right. Uh, Synactive targeting automotive grade Linux with the Blue Z Ophono Conman subsystem bonus targeting in the operating system category for $60,000. And five master opponent points. Yeah, another AGL exploit. I'm, I'm really looking forward to seeing yes. those in addition to the charge points. Well, the uh, EV chargers just in general. Okay, up next, we have Lee, Tri Lee Tran Haitung targeting the Alpine for the IVI category for $40,000 yeah. and four master opponent points. Let's see here. Team Cluck. Targeting the charge point home flex in the EV charging category for $60,000, six master opponent points. Team Cluck is a new team, but some returning competitors. Yes. Some of our favorites. Yep, and I think they'll be here in person too, won't yes, they? Yes, they will be. 32, he says. Okay, oh my goodness. Okay, we got more to go. Team Tortuga, uh, they'll be targeting the charge point home flex in the EV category for 60,000 and yep. six master opponent points. Yep, when they initially registered, they were going to be remote and then decided that they needed to be on site to run their exploits. So it'll be good to see them. Oh, yeah. They're new competitors as well. Yep. Uh, Cena targeting the Alpine device in the IVI category for $40,000, four master opponent points. I think we have 17 different countries represented, or 17 teams, yep. nine different countries, yes. right? I think so. So that's that's pretty cool. Uh, up next, Sector 7 from Computest, targeting the Autel Maxi Charger in the EV Chargers category for 60,000 and six master opponent points. All right. Keep going. Keep swimming. Keep. Just keep swimming. All right. Alex Olson targeting the Phoenix Contacts Charge device in the EV Charging category for $60,000 and six master opponent points. Okay. We're over halfway there, right? Yep. Leave it close, on a prayer. Close. Okay. Midnight Blue PHP Hooligans. Can't even say Hooligans right today. Targeting the Altel Maxi Charger wall box uh, in the EV Chargers category for sixty thousand. All right, here we go. Next up would be Ret Two System tar targeting the Juice Box EV Charger in the EV Charging category for sixty thousand dollars. Six Master Poem points. Okay, up next we have Team Cluck targeting automotive grade Linux in the OS category nice. for fifty thousand and five Master Poem points. Should be good. Should be good. All right. Uh, Neta2 targeting the Phoenix Contacts Charts device in the EV charging category for $60,000, six master opponent points. Okay. So close. Fuzzware.io, new team for us. Yep. Targeting the Phoenix Contact Charge X, Charge C H A R X. How are you supposed Charks. to? Charks. Charks. Yeah, Charks. That's not even a word. You're <laughs> making a word that's not a word. In the EV category for sixty thousand dollars and six master opponent points. All right, next up, it's going to be Katsuki Sato targeting the Pioneer device in the IVI category for forty thousand dollars, four master opponent points. Uh, following that would be Fuzzware.io targeting the Alpine Halo Nine in the IVI category for forty thousand and four master opponent. All right. All right, next up, Fuzzware.io targeting the ChargePoint HomeFlex device in the EV charging category for $60,000, six master of home points. It's getting fewer. It's, fewer. It's, it's dwindling, finally. Uh, following that, Synactive targeting the Sony letters and numbers in the IVI category, 40,000 and four master of home points. All right. Fuzzware.io targeting the Autel Maxi Charger. In the EV charging category for $60,000, six master of home points. Let's see here. We have Team Cluck targeting the Phoenix Contact Charks in the EV category for $60,000 and six master of home. Yeah. Phoenix Contact is actually on site here. They'll be working with us on the disclosures. Well, it'll be nice to see bugs. that in person. Yep. Number seven by CompuTest targeting the charge point home flex in the EV charging categories for $60,000, six master of home points. Okay, and then we have Netitude targeting Juicebox 40 Smart EV Charging Station in the EV category for 60000 and six master of phone. All right, and Cena going against the Ubiquity Connect EV Station in the EV Charging category for $60,000, six master of phone points. And the unlucky last draw. It'd be uh, Fuzzware.io targeting the Emporia EV Charger in the EV uh, chargers category for sixty thousand and six master opponent. Are they the only ones targeting Emporia? I don't really know. No, yeah, we've name. got we've okay. got several on the Emporia All devices. Right. <laughs> well, that's the last one. And uh, yeah, so that is the uh, that's the draw. And I just want to say. Good luck to all of our competitors. Good luck to all of our vendors. 
I want to say thank you to Tesla for being a partner again with us and helping co-sponsor this event, uh, as well as Vic One, uh, who has been uh, instrumental in getting everything ready. The booth looks amazing. If you are anywhere near Tokyo, I encourage you. It's free to get in uh, and just come by and see it. And hey, over a million and a half dollars we're going to award if all this stuff hits. Hopefully. Yeah, we're really looking forward to it. So stay tuned. Follow us on socials, at the ZDI, whatever social you use, uh, whatever's formerly called Twitter these days, Instagram, Mastodon, or even on threads for some reason. Uh, and of course, our blog at uh, zerodayinitiative.com. That's where we'll be posting all of our results. So with that, Brian, anything else you want to say before we no, sign off? No, we're looking forward to the event. Good luck to everybody. And, uh, you know, hopefully we'll, we'll get quite a few zero days as part of this contest and have some fun. It's going to be a great few days. It's going to be a long one. And I hope you join us with it. So, again, follow us online for the results. And we'll see you there.